what's going on, you guys? So, it's looking like the Errol Spence Jr. Terrence Bud Crawford fight is closing in. It's looking like the fight that we've been waiting for for the past three years is about to finally come to a reality. Hit that like button for your boy. Give me that HBO special. That's the help of Brother Al special. We're in the road to 20,000 subscribers. But Errol Spence Jr. and Terrence Bud Crawford. The fight that we all have been waiting for. The fight that'll top off the year of 2022 and, perhaps, and possibly being one of the greatest years in boxing in a long, long time. But the fight looks like it's closing in. And according to Mike Cappinger on ESPN, he says this. Errol Spence Jr. and Terrence Crawford are closing in on a deal for an undisputed welterweight championship fight in October in Las Vegas, sources tell ESPN. No agreement yet, but no real stumbling block. PBC pay-per-view for this genuine super fight. Yes, so it'll be PBC pay-per-view, of course. Um, probably showtime. We don't know exactly as of yet any um, details. But like I said before, I heard that the fight is a pretty much a done deal. I heard it was a done deal. Um, November, October. It's looking like it's October according to what sources got told by ESPN. So, yeah, man, this is the fight that we all been waiting for. You know, no no need to go back and forth about the negotiations. No need to go back and forth to who's getting what. We don't really, it really don't matter who's getting what at this point because this fight is closing in, right? Fans didn't get a chance to go back and forth amongst the negotiations because these guys did a good job of keeping the numbers and what these guys are getting or what they want really behind closed doors but this fight is closing in you guys and this is the fight that we all been waiting for i can't wait to start actually talking about the actual matchup i gave many breakdowns and way um ways i feel and who i feel wins the fight but you know we got to really look at it these guys are already preparing um for each other you know errol spence jr was at the fights it would take Davis and Rowley. He was already out doing his word road work. So he knows it's closing in. Terrence Crawford's already getting in the gym, getting things uh, ready. So yeah, man, it's the fight that we all been waiting for. This is the super fight between Errol Spence Jr. and Terrence Bud Crawford. I just can't wait for the official announcement. You know, um, it don't really matter who you got winning at this point. We wait for this thing to get you know, finish sign on that. There's been some narratives going around that Crawford needs to sign a contract and that stuff. All these people saying all this stuff, but this is not what you're hearing from people that's going to come out here and give it to you straight. Even the mainstream guys coming out and telling you that there's no real stumbling block, no issues, no nothing, um, no agreement yet, but they're closing in on a deal, you know, and this is what it is. And it's similar to what I've told you guys. Like, there's no, I didn't hear anything bad about this fight, right? I didn't hear anything bad behind the, behind the scenes that, you know, he was getting this, he was getting that, or, you know, there was this could potentially stop the fight now we heard what steven espinoza said and the stuff that they came out in public said but as far as you know behind the scenes with errol spence jr and terrence crawford they've been tight-lipped about what they're getting behind the scenes and that's cool that's good get this fight made can't wait for the official announcement like subscribe hot your boy peace out